गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट ऑफ क्लास एट टुडे आई विल टीच यू इंग्लिश ग्रामर चैप्टर नंबर सेवन चैप्टर नंबर सेवन इज वर्ब्स वर्ब डिफिनेशन एवरी वन यू अंडरस्टैंड वर्ब व्हाट इज अ वर्ब डिनोट व्हाट समबडी और एनी पर्सन और एनी थिंग डज इट मींस इट मींस इट रिप्रेजेंट द एक्शन और वर्क that is done by the subject okay so here you can understand the verb verb comes from the latin verbum which simply means word this tell us how important verbs are so here given about some some statement now first point here verbs can tell us what a person or thing as what i have told it means it's it uh, denotes or tells what any person or anything it means what someone somebody does here check birds are chattering birds what they are doing they are chattering what i am doing i am just teaching you so what teaching it's verb children playing suppose their children are playing so what play it's verb okay and now verb now completed okay now verb actually it's two type one is transitive verb and another is intransitive verb transitive verb very easy where there is a object required without object sentence sentence is not completed yet okay and uh, so any example ramesh bought bought manau sentence completed ramesh bought so there is a it's not complete sense there is a requirement of something ramesh bought what bought ramesh bought a pen now complete a pen now this object this is the region it's what it's intransitive okay sorry sorry it's a transitive ramesh bought a pen transitive sentence and intransitive where there is a no requirement of object without object sentence is in complete sense suppose that the baby laughs the baby laughs now complete sense okay here given the verb is a very complex part of speech is it has tense number aspect mode and otherwise so verb can be transitive or intransitive some transitive verbs are linking verb and some can be finite or etc and auxiliary and modal auxiliary about gerund participle and etc detail given i had already told you okay now so what to do in in this section you have to write down verbs definition of verb transitive and intransitive okay transitive verb intransitive verb definition and one one example you have to do and on the next page there is exercise related to verbs there are actually 15 maybe more more than 15 sentence are there but i think words are more maybe 20 i think but there are some words which meaning just very similar means very exactly same like so you have to check what is the exact meaning of it then use it in sentences okay 15 verb 15 required here are two gaps so two required 15 1 16 okay so check it today you have to do it this one exercise you have to do okay thank you for today tomorrow i will tell you another